more and more of my clients are reaching out to me asking me what type of uh, software that we use to run virtual meetings and zoom hands down would be the best one there's um, quite a bit of services out there that are free as well such as uh, skype video facetime uh, you can do a uh, go to meeting um, there's a lot of solutions out there but hands down it's going to be zoom and with zoom uh, for example if you're funeral home you can now if families are a little bit afraid to come in uh, at the current moment you can do zoom conference call they get to see you you get to see them from the comfort of their home they can do it from this little tiny device you get to see each other and you can also do screen sharing while you're talking to them you can uh, hop on your website uh, you can screen share your products and services so you can do one-on-one -on -one selling you can do group uh, presentations that say webinars format let's say right now uh, if you're conducting seminars, uh, lunch and learns, these days not too many people will want to uh, meet up right now. So you can do Zoom as well, right? So you can uh, do a virtual seminar. Same thing, you're running through slides, they get to see you, they get to see your slides as well. Uh, so a lot of applications, same thing if you're a home improvement contractor right now, your most likely families wouldn't want you to be inside your house. So same thing, you can do a virtual appointment, right? So uh, for example, uh, you guys can hop on, the homeowner and you can hop on in Zoom conference call. Again, you get to see each other. They can pan across their room, right? Like this, showing you their windows that need to be replaced. They can show them exactly how to measure the windows, get a rough estimate, and can give them quote. So a lot of things can be done virtually. Over here at Ring Ring, we do, um, for example, one-on-one -on -one meetings with my employees. Even when they start typing on a message of me through uh, Slack or through Teams or Skype, I always say, let's hop on a Zoom, <laughs> right? We get to see each other, less confusion, just much easier to get uh, the message across. So we do our group meetings, right? company-wide meetings, we have 53 employees, so everything's done um, through Zoom. So let me show you how to sign up for a Zoom account. Okay, and it's very, very easy. You go to zoom.us, then on the top right -hand corner, you click on sign up, it's free. Then over here, you type in your email and click sign up, okay? Then it will send you a link to confirm. So then over here, you'll click on, right, activate your account. Okay, so I already um, signed up for the account before. But once you click here, what it will do is it will give you a URL. That is your personal uh, Zoom link. So once you sign up, this is what will happen. Let me show you. It will ask you to download a little software on here. Then for future purposes, very, very easy. All you do is, right, you have this installed on your desktop now. You, what you have to do is copy invitation. That's always the same channel, right? For example, you want to meet with a family. All you have to do is send them this. So they can go on this link. And it's very easy for you to launch. So all you have to do is send them this link here. If they um, want, they can call in. They can dial in as well to the meeting. And it's very easy. You just hit start Zoom. And uh, once you start Zoom, for example, then you will see each other. Uh, I'm using recording software, so um, you will not be able to see me <laughs> on, on Zoom as a demo over here. You can easily hit share screen. And now you're sharing your screen. 
So it's super, super easy to uh, sign up for Zoom. And the limitation, let's talk about the free account, the limitation over here. So you basically get unlimited. Let's go on pricing over here. So once you click pricing, the free account gives you quite a bit of flexibility already. You have unlimited one-to-one -one meetings. So it's just one-to-one -one selling or one to just one family. They're all on the same uh, computer. Then you basically get unlimited meetings in length. But if it's to group meetings where multiple people will be joining your meeting from multiple computers, then this free account only limits to 40 minutes. So if most of your meetings are shorter than that, you're totally fine with a free account. But if you need to run meetings a little bit longer than 40 minutes, then just sign up for the pro account. It's, um, yeah, it's uh, not very expensive to run a business for 15 bucks a month. Okay. And if you have any questions, feel free to reach out.